Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's your girl coming at you with another awesome video. You guys will see this get up again because I just made a video. I'm trying to previous record videos, if that makes sense. It does, you guys know. But yeah, anyway, today will be like a more of a talking video, more of something like a story time, kind of like a story time. Like, what's it like to be 30? Let me tell you. There is a big damn difference when you turn 30. And I'm just going to give you guys some pointers, a little bit of a story time, which is why I think I'm going to name it that. Yeah, but anyway, um, yeah, as you guys know, or if you don't know, I'm 30 years old. Your girl's birthday is February 4th, so technically I just turned 30. Um, damn, I'm about to be 31 because February is around the corner. But yeah, anyway, when I turned 30, I, it made me look back at... A lot of the things I used to do in my younger days, like when I was in my teenage and in my 20s and my mid, my early 20s, mid 20s to my late 20s. Um, it made me just look back at it like it's like watching yourself in a movie somewhat, something like that. And it's like a lot of the things I wish I didn't do. I wish I would have went another route. I wish I did a lot of things, but I can't harbor on that forever. But there are good things about turning 30 and being 30 as well as there's bad things. Now, let me start with the bad. Let me tell you. My opinion. What's happening to me? When I turned 30, I promise you me, it seemed like my health went downhill. Like, literally, it went downhill. It seemed like everything was starting to pop up. Like, um, hold on. <coughs> Excuse me. I don't know if you guys noticed, but you see me do this a lot in my videos, like, like that swallowing. It's like your girl is just out of whack. Just literally Saturday, I was in the hospital. It was a respiratory infection, and it's like as soon as I turned thirty, there was so many issues, like especially like with my breathing. Sometimes I'm wheezing a lot, and it's just I do believe it has a lot to do with my weight. Your girl got to lose weight. That's a must. But it's also inner health issues. And it just seems like everything is going down here, like health-wise. And, and there are things that I can do to better that. But it seems like when I hit 30, honey, everything was like, oh. oh it's done. It's a wrap. But it's just going down here. And it is a little harder to lose weight when you get older. And I'm only 30, so yeah. Um, What else? Good things are your girls still get carded. Um, and I'm 30 years old. Like, okay, it's gonna boost me up. But another thing is, um, let me see. Um, I can get into the grown and sexy clubs because we all know when you what 15, 16, well, not everybody, you trying to get into the clubs and then you have to be 18 and then you gotta be 21 and drinking. And all that. But then there are certain clubs when you're 21, you can't get in because it's 25 and up. Well, your girl is in the 25 and up club now. Like, I'm the grown and sexy club, which I can say I enjoy. But the thing is, I hardly, I wouldn't really go to anything younger than that. It's like when you turn 30, well, not specifically 30, but when you get older, it's like, what I look like going to a club where a bunch of teenagers at and look young bucks. Like, what I look like going you do get that feeling, that aura around you. You're like, you're like mm, no, I'm good. And when you, and also when you turn 30, you get way more mature. I mean, there are people who are uh, 16 and under who are mature for their age. And there are people who are 30 who are immature as hell. But yeah, I know a couple. But uh, anyway, it's like you get more mature. You're more wiser. You're growing to your wisdom, basically. You don't get super wise until I think later than that, later than 30. But it is what it is. Everybody's different. But I can say this, that there are differences in a lot of things. Like some things I look back at and I'm like, uh, I truly wish I would have did that different or I wish I would have tried that or, or didn't do this or said that or didn't. You know, it's so much, but you can't harbor on that forever. Um... But, wow, it was, it, you know, turning 30 is an experience in itself. On my birthday, literally, it was just another day to me. Like, and that's another thing. The older you get, birthdays are, like, literally just another day. Like, oh, yeah, yeah, I made it another year, which is wonderful, which is a blessing. Let me tell you, that's a blessing to make it another day. 
But it just it's just not all that important to you, especially when you have kids. Your birthday like kind of go on the back burner a little. I mean, not that it bothers me because it's, yeah, it is what it is. As long as somebody say happy birthday, which I did have a a, a nice um, 30th birthday with just me and the babe. But yeah, turning 30 isn't like a big, huge like thing. If that makes sense, it's, it is what it is. Everybody, when you turn 30, they want to have the dirty 30 birthday. But I didn't do that. I mean, I, I actually I wish I would have, but it is what it is. I had an awesome time. But like turning 30 isn't that bad. I'm not like one of the the older women who look down at these young girls like, oh my God, like what is she doing? What is she wearing? No, I'm not. I'm probably the one they're looking at like, what is she doing? What is she wearing? <laughs> I'm in between. I'm having fun. I'm still alive. That's all I really care about. Um, what else? Um, what can I say? It's like being 30 is like you're halfway there to 50. That's what you're thinking. That's what I think. And it's like, I have so much more that I need to do and I want to do at the same time. But, yeah, I think that's it for this video, guys. It's just a small talking video. I mean, I don't think I hardly have any of these types of videos. Um, yeah, that's about it on my opinion on what's it like to be 30 years old. Oh, my God. <laughs> but, yes, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to comment, like, and, of course, subscribe. It is free. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will catch you in my next video. And don't forget, this week your girl is coming back. She's busting these videos out like a stripper on the stage. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. But I will catch you guys in my next video. Peace, and I will see you later.